There are two powers in the world, one is the sword and the other is the pen. There is a third power stronger than both, that of women. A woman is like a tea bag, you never know how strong it is until it's in hot water. I do not try to dance better than anyone else. I only try to dance better than myself. Women have to harness their power, it's absolutely true. It's just learning not to take the first no. And if you can't go straight ahead, you go around the corner. A woman with a voice is, by definition, a strong woman. We need women at all levels, including the top, to change the dynamic, reshape the conversation, to make sure women's voices are heard and heeded, not overlooked and ignored. We need to reshape our own perception of how we view ourselves. We have to step up as women and take the lead. No woman should be told she can't make decisions about her own body. When women's rights are under attack, we fight back. I attribute my success to this, I never gave or took any excuse. I am a woman with thoughts and questions and shit to say. I say if I'm beautiful. I say if I'm strong. You will not determine my story, I will. Courage doesn't always roar. Sometimes courage is the little voice at the end of the day, that says I'll try again tomorrow. I don't like the marginalization of women, when the fighting breaks out. We get to fight too. I think the best role models for women are, people who are fruitfully and confidently themselves, who bring light into the world. There's something so special about a woman who dominates in a man's world. It takes a certain grace, strength, intelligence, fearlessness, and the nerve to never take no for an answer. Think like a queen. A queen is not afraid to fail. Failure is another stepping stone to greatness. Women and cats will do as they please, and men and dogs should relax and get used to the idea. I would venture to guess that Anon, who wrote so many poems without signing them, was often a woman. A lady's imagination is very rapid, it jumps from admiration to love, from love to matrimony in a moment. Well-behaved women seldom make history. Being a woman is a terribly difficult trade since it consists principally of dealings with men. You educate a man, you educate a man. You educate a woman, you educate a generation. A girl should be two things classy and fabulous. How wrong is it for a woman, to expect the man to build the world she wants, rather than to create it herself? No woman really wants a man to carry her off, she only wants him to want to do it. In politics, if you want anything said, ask a man. If you want anything done, Ask a woman. I measure the progress of a community, by the degree of progress, which women have achieved. Men are by nature merely indifferent to one another, but women are by nature enemies. Men are governed by lines of intellect, women, by curves of emotion. I guess at the end of the day, all women like to be appreciated and treated with respect and kindness. One can find women who have never had one love affair, but it is rare indeed to find any who have had only one.
women don't realize how powerful they are. A woman should be like a single flower, not a whole bouquet. Most women set out to try to change a man, and when they have changed him they do not like him. She was powerful not because she wasn't scared, but because she went on so strongly, despite the fear. A woman is the full circle. Within her is the power to create, nurture and transform. The best protection any woman can have, is courage. You are more powerful than you know, you are beautiful just as you are. A strong woman is a woman, determined to do something others are determined not be done. When women and girls are empowered to participate fully in society, everyone benefits. A strong woman looks a challenge dead in the eye and gives it a wink. We need to get women to the point where they aren't apologizing. It is time to take ownership in our success. Women will have achieved true equality when men share with them the responsibility of bringing up the next generation. Women are the real architects of society. Women belong in all places where decisions are being made. It shouldn't be that women are the exception. It took me quite a long time to develop a voice, and now that I have it, I am not going to be silent. Women have always been the strong ones of the world. 